So DMZ has a teeny weeny little issue at the moment that kind of just completely breaks the progression. The new Phalanx faction doesn't reward you with enough reputation to unlock a story mission, which means you have to use the new urgent missions to gain that little bit of extra rep. Sounds pretty easy. However, to do that, you first have to unlock the urgent missions for Phalanx. And to unlock them, you need to extract three items. They're brand new, added with Season 4. Hydrogen Peroxide, Acetone, and Cephalexin. Again, sounds simple enough, but it isn't. Right now, the only intel that we've really got about these new items is they spawn in hospital buildings around Almazra. The issue is, they're so rare, and almost everyone is trying to find them, so extracting even one of these things is currently extremely difficult. Our solo adventure today begins in the far north of Almazra, searching for these new rare items. Enjoy. Even if I can just find one, I'm tempted to be conservative and secure that. Once you get to a certain point, you literally can't progress any further without doing the urgent missions. So there's currently a bit of a roadblock going on for the entire DMZ community, which means everyone is going after these items. So if we can find them, great news. Now, I know there's a way to show you what these look like, and it's in here. See these bottles? This is them, and it literally says hydrogen peroxide on it. Now, unfortunately, you can't pick these bottles up because they're just like the assets and not the actual bottles that you can you can interact with. So you just have to hit the hospitals in Almazra and hope you find them. I'm guessing it's going to be on a shelf somewhere, a bit like that one that we saw downstairs. So that's the radiation blocker, bandage, radiation blocker, and documents, another stim. Have a look in here. Battle rage, liquor. There's none here. Aspirin. Need that right now. Okay, so there's none in the main part of the hospital. In here? No. None in the main part of the hospital, which is disappointing. I'm going to check the tents as well. Make sure there's nobody pushing over. Okay. Nothing in there. That's another stim. Medical tents are always a good place to double check, just in case you might find them. We've got a revive pistol, AFAC, battery, another revive pistol. What have I got in that? Oh, I've got some ammunition. Okay, so first hospital, no equipment that we need, which is a shame. There is a vehicle over here. Is that player? Was that an AI? I think that was an AI around the back there. Yeah, it was. They, they are players. They are actually players who have shot me, didn't present any kind of threat to them. They have decided I was worthy of being eliminated. The only thing I can do is run out in the open with one plate and hopefully not get hit. <laughs> it's literally a duck shoot for them. Quack, quack, quack. Good thing they're not a great shot. There's three plates straight off. Oh. Oh, wow, we got lucky there. Three plate break on the guy. And then <laughs> an LTV comes along out of nowhere. There they are. Let's hit again. I haven't got the highest velocity Imperium on here. There you are. Pretty sure teammates are going to be pushing me. And there was definitely more than one guy up there. I'm just a humble solo that wants to check hospitals. That's all I want to do. Into the back of the building. Get ruined. Naughty, naughty. Goodness me, I got away with one there, didn't I? I will take refuge in this building right now. <laughs> hmm. Can't remember where I was. Here I was. He had nothing. I don't even know if he was part of their team. I don't think he was. They're still trying it, you know. They're still bloody trying it. 
Is there three of them? Well, I'm not going to res you now. You tried to kill me. Right, they've moved off into Rohan. Fine. We'll let you go. But no, I'm not resing you, mate. I'm sorry. I'm not doing it. You've tried to push up on me. I was posing no threat. I was shooting somebody else. And you tried to kill me. So, as a way of payback, you shall now lie on the floor dead. And I'm not going to go straight to the hospital. Look, there's a couple of vehicles out here already. I'm going to pull up before the hospital. In fact, I might go up the... Uh, might go up on top of the post office and see if I can parachute across. Is me going the wrong way again. Right. What did that drop? Ah, the truck's gone. The truck that was there has disappeared. Someone was in this area not long ago. Now, did they go to the hospital? And did they leave anyone behind? There we go. Pretty sure this will have been checked, but... Hey ho, we'll give it a go. Maybe it hasn't been checked. It hasn't. Right, anything there that we're looking for? Medical documents. Spare, small stand, watch. No, nothing there. Bandage, radiation blocker. Okay. Radiation blocker. Wow. Okay, not there then. This reminds me of the blowtorch back in, like, season two, when they, they made it a meme because you needed to collect a load of blowtorches to put them in the dead drop, do you remember? And um, I think then on a Sheikah Island there was a mission where you had to, like, find, like, ten of them or something. It was just almost impossible to do. Wow, these things are really hard to find. Yeah, these are the things, but they're not, they're not here. They're just not here. Purified water. Okay, right, so that is the that is the second hospital we have now checked, with no luck. Just going to check the petrol station. We've got some plates here. There's always a lot of things on the shelves in the petrol station, so it's worth a double check. Petrol stations can be really helpful. Gun cleaning oil. Nope, that's been opened. Okay, nothing of actual note. Right, let's go to the next one. Next hospital is over here. Supply drops incoming. Okay, why is that chopper right there? Just realised that. Chopper's just sitting right there. Interesting. What is that with the cars at the moment? You're flying forward as soon as you get out of them. This one's definitely been looted. I think a lot, like I say, a lot of people are going for these things right now. So I, I think people are being like super, super conservative. So like if they find one, they're, they're just going to like extract with it straight away. Like just to secure it, you know, so they can check one off the list. And do you know what's even worse with these things? Like you guys will have to do this too. So hopefully they patch it to make it a little bit easier to find these things. But you are going to have to extract them yourself. They do not share across to someone else if you extract them. They are linked to you directly. So if you want to progress the Phalanx faction, you're going to have to do what I'm doing right now. And if you find one and you're playing with a trio or something, you are not going to be able to uh, to share that progress with someone else. So, uh, just saying. You got a lot of work cut out for you. Again, they're right here. These should be the items, and they haven't enabled them. I feel like these should be the ones. Like, you should be able to hit these hospitals. So there should be 10 of these on the map, and then they should also spawn in the hospitals as well, like, just randomly on different areas. But no, we don't have that. 
believe this one has also been looted. Yes, it has. Is I a radar dome key, though? Not going to say no. Got to build up that key stash again. And they wiped it all. Yeah, I, I don't think we're going to find these things. I think the people that will have found them will have already found them. <laughs> I don't think we're going to be as lucky as we think. Stim. No. Stim. Radiation blocker. No. 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 <sighs> just check the small ones. But everyone knows to check these, so yeah. I reckon you just have to get super lucky that one of these is just sitting on another shelf and that you can collect it. Like I say, I've done like three or four matches now. And I've not found a single one. The only other thing is that maybe you like tail a team that are doing the, the, the hospitals in front of you. And if you do that and then they find what you're looking for, murder them. <laughs> and then take it. That's going to be like the only way to do it, right? There is um, one more hospital we can check over at Sour, but I've got a feeling that one will also be uh, empty when it comes to what we're looking for here. We've got some fuel in here. So, there's, Oh, actually, like I said, the fuel system has now changed in the game, so you can now siphon fuel from cars, but watch this. So I've got low fuel, but it's not completely empty. If I fuel it up, uh, I've still got 7% in my gas can because there was still 7% fuel left in the car. So when you click on the gas can now, it fuels it back up to the top. Um... But it leaves you the rest of the gas still in the can. So if I then wanted to click it again, it fills it up a little bit more. And it takes that other 7% and puts it in. So if you're one of those, like, I don't know, warriors and you don't want to be like running out of fuel, you can fill it up halfway and you'll stuff 50% in the gas can. But if you're like me, I just tend to leave it to like the last minute and then just click it. Um, but I guess it can work in two different ways. Because you could actually, because you can now siphon gas out of people's cars. That is from earlier. That was over at Rohan that GMC um, but yeah you can siphon the gas out of people's cars so if you knew there was an enemy team like lurking around but you could get near their vehicle you could siphon the gas out of their car scare them they get back in their vehicle and there's no fuel in it which is a really cool feature I think so uh, yeah I'd uh, look out for some more uh, extreme plays when it comes to fueling up your cars in the near future got a feeling people are going to start doing that I think there might be somebody here, you know. The AI are already running around. Yep. There's a player, like, over here. Hey there. Are you having trouble with the AI? Do you want some help? Hmm. I think I was a bit out of range. They've moved on already, so... I don't think they're going to hear me. I hope that player isn't now in the building that I want to go in. I'm pretty sure that this will have already been looted. Really don't want this player coming in here. Hopefully they moved off. They're on the jet ski. They're on the jet ski out there, so that's fine. We can have a quick look. Oh, it was two men. It was two men. I, I genuinely don't think we're going to find what we're looking for today. It's a shame because I can't actually progress without finding this stuff. See, I feel like it might spawn like here. Because this bed is empty. Normally that's got something on it. I don't think it's going to be in these first aid cabinets. I genuinely don't think it will be there. I feel like it would be quite obvious. And unfortunately, they're just it's not where I'm expecting it to be. But this has already been looted. Look, people going in here trying to find it and not finding it. I reckon they will actually patch the game because there's no way they can leave it as it is, I don't think. Now, what does the jet ski do when you get off it? Oh, that works perfectly. So it's just cars that throw themselves forward into the into the future when you get off them at the moment. So we had that little bit of a fight at the start and then things have calmed down since then. Which is good news, really, because you don't want to do too much PvP as a solo. It's good fun, don't get me wrong. But like, you know. <laughs> um, what was that? Did you hear that boom, 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 boom? That sounded like an LTV cannon. That actually did sound like an LTV cannon. That's because it might well have been an LTV cannon. Oh no. 
Right, okay. We've got a lot of AI coming in here. And now we've got an LTV with a cannon at the exfil that I want to use. Okay, let's find a better position. Add her onto the roof. Yeah, there he goes. You can see him going up there now. No, that's AI. Oh, there they are. Three of them. In they go. They've not done anything to me, so I won't shoot them. Unless they shoot at me. <laughs> they are shooting the vehicles so people can't use them. That's fair enough. No one people using the LTV. I get it. Haven't seen me, though. I'm quite surprised they haven't seen me, to be fair. You see me. And... Ooh, there they go. That's them out of there. Now, what we've got to be careful of... What was that noise? Did you hear that? I don't know what that was. We've got to get ourselves out of this extract too. No. No, thank you. I do not want that. At least they didn't kill anybody here. That's good news. This building here usually has a ladder on the inside of it. I think it can get you up to the roof. I think you can get on the roof from inside the building. You can, which is perfect. Gives me a little position to hold whilst we wait for the chopper to come in. A hmm, little bit tense at the start of the round with that team that just shot me as soon as I came out of the hospital. Really disappointed we didn't actually get what we needed. I'm hoping for an update in the next couple of days because if they can update it, then great news. Then it should make it easier for you to... Oh, no. Sniper looking at me. You got shots, huh? Check out if you don't want to jump out. Mm. They were looking with a sniper as soon as I started. Oh, this is not fun, is it? I don't know where I've got the advanced UAV deployed. Of course, I've got a stealth vest. So that helps me immensely. Bad stim. Perfect. Need that. Now, because I've got the stealth vest, even with an advanced UAV, they can't, they can't see me. The only thing is, on their minimap anyway, the only thing is, is if they know where I am, then it doesn't really make a difference. He was just looking straight at me. Whoa. Is my stealth vest not working or something? Is my stealth vest just not working? I'm not sure what happened there. We gotta wait for fucking four minutes. He wasn't very happy. So yeah, unfortunately, we didn't get any of the items we need. So we're still stuck on being able to not make... But we can't make any progress on, on Phalanx because we need to unlock the urgent missions. So as I was saying, hopefully they'll put out an update soon, which will be, help, be able to help people progress. But at the moment, I think a lot of people are fight, trying to find these new bottles and uh, there's only very small quantities of them, which it makes things a little bit difficult. So I wouldn't be surprised if you see an update in the next few days. But right now, I think um, DMZ is a little bit broke. But um, thanks very much for watching, guys. Appreciate it. And uh, I'll catch you soon.